taking on of me just want to cut up, you know what I'm saying? Like that was a word that been that been a Baton Rouge slang, but I just used it in my own way like, man, shit. Man, I'm going out tonight, man, I'm about to cut up bad, man, you know what I'm saying? I'm about to cut up, you know what I'm saying? So that whole concept, it, it, it came from me just feeling like how I was feeling. And then, you know, you know, Bezo came in and added some extra little flavor to it, so it kind of made it what it what it is, you know what I'm saying? Right. But the, the whole concept just came from how I felt when I put, when I made that beat. I made that beat right then and there. I didn't even have a keyboard. I made that shit right on the keypad. Right, and, right. You know, I, I, I felt that it was a club hit, so I was just thinking of something, you know what I'm saying? And that and that what came out. Any you know plans of a remix to it? Cause I want it. I want it to be a I'm remix. I'm feeling like it's gonna be a remix soon. I bro. want it. I definitely want it yeah. to be a remix. Anybody you 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 want on? You want to throw out there any hints? Man, bro. I feel like whoever can get on that bitch and rip. Like I, you know, I got the instrumental on YouTube. I got the instrumental on YouTube on my uh on my YouTube channel, which is uh Better Produce Production. I put that on there and uh, they had uh, they had uh, Titanic uh, did a uh, did a little freestyle to it. Spitter did his thing on it and Lil won the champ. Mm, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So they did their thing on it or whatever like that. So I, I I heard I heard a little bit of Spitter, but not not all of it. But from what I heard from him, he ripped it. Uh, Titanic, she ripped it. I'm, I, she did her thing. And um, Lil Wanna Champ, I'm, I'm just wait, waiting to hear from him. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, if it becomes a good remix, I mean, you know, whoever won't get on it, if it's a big dog or if it's somebody that's coming out the woodwork that, that know they won't cut up bad shit. Yeah. I, I, I just, I just want to hear it go farther than, you know what I'm saying, than where is that now? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Any more songs with you and BZ on it or that was just the only one? Or? Where, uh, with BZ? Yeah, uh, yeah, that that was a uh, that was that was like the only record. That's the only collab y'all got because it's something yeah. y'all need to do a mixtape together. Well, I don't know, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know. Uh, all right, all right. I, I don't know. I mean, uh, we had some we had some work going on, but uh, uh, we had some business uh, stuff that wasn't that wasn't properly handled. So we trying right. to get that straight out the way before right. anything else get released. Right, 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 all right, all right. Well, that's yeah. what's up, then. All right, well, music for the streets, yeah. business for the streets. I mean, yeah. but uh, like I said, man, I mean, we in here chopping up with DJ Be Real, bro. Yeah. Exclusive yeah. interview, Power to Tell podcast. Yeah. I appreciate them, you know what I'm saying? Oh, Let man, me come through and just represent the streets of Baton Rouge, you know what I'm saying? I'm yeah. trying to move around, I'm yeah. trying to, you know, like anybody that, that trying to do something, I'm trying to put them on a platform yeah. and show some love, bro. Yeah. We ain't trying to hate, we trying to show love and, and create, baby. And, and, and I appreciate the love that you giving me. I appreciate you coming out, you know, giving me this exclusive interview that, you know what I'm saying, most people don't know about, you know what I'm saying? And and I and I just thank you for that, man. And you doing and you doing what's right, you know what I'm saying? They gotta hear, hear the voice of the streets, man. They gotta hear what's going on out, you know what I'm saying? And you getting all exclusive content right here, you know what I'm saying? Right. So yeah. one more time before we go, bro. You know, um, if you had to give a a message to the youth in the streets, what would it be? Man, the message is, bro, for the youth is to stay, 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 stay consistent with, with, with something that's positive that's gonna get you out of. If you in poverty, do something positive that's gonna get you out of it. You know what I'm saying? I mean, the, the, the streets here. You know what I'm saying? The streets ain't going nowhere. So once you leave it from here, it's like, shoot, the streets still gonna be here. So if you in, if you in here doing, if you doing, God knows what to what, like it's, it's gonna upset your, your mother, your, your family and stuff like that, don't do it, man. Just, you know what I'm saying, strive to be great. If you got a talent, use your talent to get out. You ain't gotta do what everybody doing, you know what I'm saying? You ain't gotta, you know what I'm saying, be what the next man is, a dope boy and all that. You ain't gotta do all that. I mean, it's, you know what I'm saying, it's fast money, but it can take your life fast, you know what I'm saying? So. Definitely don't want to put yourself in that situation where, like, you know what I'm saying, you want to leave here early. If you got a talent, man, showcase your talent and let another person that's trying to do what you're doing show them the right way of doing it, not doing it the wrong way. If you got a good talent that you know that you can make it legally, do that. You know what I'm saying? 
know, my that's Already. my message to the youth, bro. And Already. you in the Already. music industry, bro, just Already. stay stay consistent for once. You know what I'm saying? Stay on you on your grind. Don't never give up. Sometimes you can it may feel like, you know what I'm saying, you wanna give it up. Cause I be feeling like that sometimes. But I got I thank God that I got people that love me, that that that, that see me wanna do great, that's keeping me you know what I'm saying, focus with what I'm doing, which is my talent, something that I love, you know what I'm saying? And don't get me wrong, it, it, you know what I'm saying? It, it's just like working a nine to five, if you working labor work. Like this shit is, is hard. Just because y'all listening to it for four minutes, we gotta be in the studio producing this here for several hours, you know what I'm saying? We gotta lay this down for several hours and it's not an easy task. For every breakdown we gotta do, like we gotta do this shit to perfect it the right way for the listeners to listen. And we only taking three to two to four minutes of y'all time to even listen to. Yeah. So, you know what I'm saying? It's like something to think about. Yeah, for real. Like, like that's really something to think about. But just stay persistent with it. If you in the music game, bro, stay persistent. Have your business in order. You know what I'm saying? Learn about BMI and ASCAP. Learn about, you know what I'm saying, you, you getting your publishing, keeping your publishing. You know what I'm saying? Make a decision whether if you want to have long-term money or short-term money. You know what I'm saying? Right then and now money. You know what I'm saying? The choice is yours.